In 2003, Miriam Matembe, together with Mugisha Muntu, Bidandi Sali and the later Ria Kategaya steadfastly opposed the move to remove presidential term limits during a retreat in Changkwanzi. She would later pay for this blatant objection when a cabinet reshuffle saw her cast aside. Her divergent views ended the 17-year political relationship she had enjoyed with President Museveni and the National Resistance Movement. Eleven years later, NRM all guards with the help of some young tax unanimously resolved to support Museveni as the sole NRM flag bearer in the 2016 general election. In what she described as an orchestrated plan to stay in power, Matembe says she could not be more disappointed with her former boss for going against the very principles he once stood for. President Museveni behaves as if he is equal to Uganda, he owns Uganda, and he's the only Ugandan. And it is very sad because this is a gentleman who resented Oboti's perception eh, and managing of Uganda as the only one who could manage Uganda. Matembe also had no kind words for Museveni for undermining the democracy in the party. She cannot see anything but political doom for Uganda. Let me tell you for sure, what these people are doing in Chankwanzi and the gagging of other people from speaking and the conscription of political space with the public order management bill, this is certainly a sure way of degenerating into real violence and chaos. The tough-talking Matembe also lashed out at senior members of the party for not guiding the young tax, who have effectively given Museveni another shot at the presidency. I'm more angry with those big ones, people like Honorable Mbabazi. Yet why should I put these honorable titles? Eh? People like the Migerekos, people like the Rugundas, people, all those, at least those people, those people who started leading this country since Museveni came to power. They should know better. But how can they now also join with these little girls that have come on board and they conspire on how to really destroy this country? One of the senior members of the party, Ruhakana Rugunda, has scoffed out at Matembe. Whether one agrees or disagrees with my sister, Miriam Matembe, she is entitled to say her mind and speak what she wants to speak. But let me also add that young members of the movement either in age or in attainment of membership, have a right uh, to express their views in any way they want. Honorable Bonite has her right to move a motion if she, she so wants. Rugunda, who confessed to have abstained from the signing of the motion endorsing Museveni because of his position as the chairman of the NRM Electoral Commission, said that the caucus decision can only stand the test of time. But there are other organs of the party. There is the Central Executive Committee. There is the National Executive Committee. There is the National Conference of the Movement. None of these three key organs have discussed the matter yet. So there is a lot of room for people who may wish to express their views, either in support or against or in any different direction. Although endorsed by the NRM caucus, Museveni is likely to face off with former Vice President Gilbert Bukenya, who has made clear his intentions to run for presidency. Solomon Serwanja, NTV.